Good evening, ladies, gentlemen, everybody in between. My name's Callum, and today we are going to try our 17th attempt to get out of hell in Hades. Uh, don't know how this is going to go. Uh, we didn't actually do that well yesterday, which is kind of a shame because I really enjoyed the build that we had going. Um, I just really messed up when it came to uh, picking between, who was it, Dionysus and uh, Zeus. waiting for me in the courtyard Achilles Exegriff never entirely believed it was real between us lad I wish it wasn't was such a thing available to my enemies during my fighting days I surely would have come here even sooner but I trust you have the training to use it well may it serve you as it served the fire goddess Hestia she hasn't needed it in a while I'll use it to the best of my ability sir Have I given a Patroclus? So that's his name. Ah, uh, I haven't yet. I'm gonna uh, let's see if Medusa is about. Nix must be someplace else. I'm gonna try and see if uh, Medusa is here, so I can give us this nectar. Because if not, then I'll. I could give it to Daddy Kins, or I could give it to Megara. Ah, uh, we'll give it to Megara. I know you're just doing your job out there, and anyway, found this, thought of you and all that, so here. Uh, I'll see to it. This contraband is put away at once. Now, take your finer fee and go about your business. I, uh, thanks. Okay. Get out of my sight, Zagreus. And be thankful violence is prohibited in here. She's sassy and I love it. Oh, for shame, boy. I thought perhaps you'd finally made it out. Really? I mean, oh, wait, you're not serious. That famous sense of humor shining through. I jest, of course, you'll never make it out, as I keep telling you to no avail. But you've gone farther than expected. So who knows? It almost sounds like he's got a little bit of faith, which is weird. Your asking price, good contractor. Well worth the fruits of your hard work, I'm sure. So, like, this is all just here to, like, upgrade the look of our places. Uh, I'm not that fussed about that right now. Like, these are what I'm going to save up for here. And then if we can get some more diamonds, that will be quite nice. So we'll keep on top of that for now. Orpheus. Say Orpheus, if I ever tell you I once single-handedly slew a multi-headed bone hydra within the magma fields of Asphodel without so much as breaking a sweat. My, that is wonderful to hear, my friend. Another in a litany of such heroic deeds, more noble than the heroes of our verse, and even great Achilles over there. I'm glad you think so, mate. These tales of my valorous accomplishments do seem to cheer you up, so I will keep reporting back once I rack up some more. <laughs> I like that. Just a nice little... Hey, don't worry, champ. We'll get there. We'll get there eventually. What's new? Walls of death laughter. All right. Can't sleep. Three thousand three hundred and fifty one enemies killed. God dang. The mirror of night, we can't upgrade anything because we don't have a thousand. Uh so this is what we're talking about yesterday. We can get these Teutonic keys and we can reveal more talents, which are these passive abilities here. Um So that's what we're gonna try and look for. I don't know why you'd want to reset your talents if you can afford to max everything out. Uh, but yeah, I kind of want to take a look at that, really. What's Stygian Soul? A 
Let's try this. Uh. Okay. Restore 30% instead of dying when your life total is depleted one time per character. Dang. Restore dark regeneration. Restore health when you get, get darkness. That was fiery presence. Deal bonus attack and special damage when striking undamaged foes. Okay, so you, uh, you can swap your talents around. I never knew this. This actually opens up a world of possibility. We're going to keep the darkness for now in case we unlock more talents. But that's definitely something we can look into because that's kind of interesting, actually. Skelly, what's up, boy? Come on, mate. Won't you say who hired you? Was it Achilles? Couldn't have been Nix. Is it that big a deal? I am an individual of some integrity, boyo, and protect my sources with my life. You'll have to kill me if you want to make me squeal. I mean, sure. Why not? Right, so last time we used... The old shield. Did have a lot of luck on that, if I'm honest with you. Um, this one here, we're able to get 20% more darkness. Sword. I'll gain more darkness with this. Why not? Stygious. You're revealing your past. Three seconds after your special, your attack may deal critical damage. 15% crit chance. Hmm. That would be quite handy. By doing this, we could potentially go for like a crit build. Because if I have... Let me check if I have Artemis's. Let's see what that one does. What's the Scully ring? 20% damage while at 30% or less. That's quite cool. Uh, I don't have Arth like a boon from Artemis, which I'm sure is one of these here. So we won't do the crit run just yet. We'll have a standard sword. I'm just trying to think about who we might be able to get some use out of, like, boon-wise. I'm not entirely sure that any of these will do. Like, Poseidon might be handy. Um... <coughs> Alternatively, I could just go for the Black Shawl, where you get 15% more damage uh, striking undamaged foes or striking from behind. We can always just like dash behind people and just go like that. I just realized that the mic arm is in front of my face. My bad. Uh, I am... We're going to go for Poseidon. We'll give it a go. Why not? Oh dear. I'm very tired today. It's that midweek lull. I feel my hair always falls out of my hat. <laughs> we use Tempest Flourish. That looks very cool. Easy enough. Yeah, uh, Chitonic Key. Or Catonic? Chitonic? Something along those lines. Easy enough. You see Daedalus Hammer, you typically go for it. So that's what we're going to do here. 
This knockback's going to be very handy because it also means that we get like the wall slams if it doesn't kill them straight away. It's like here with the big boy. You got 30 extra damage from the wall slam. I should not have taken a hit there. That was my fault completely. Time to mix up my stuff. Um... Supernova. A blade fit for a god. Massive. Massive damage. Massive area. That's what we like to see. We're into that. We're into that big time. Go for Dionysus. Uh, don't really want to have to upgrade the POM with the POM of power yet. Who's next? Easy enough. You're getting somewhere, getting somewhere, man. I understand you made it up to Asphodel before. Now that is progress. Keep it up. You keep on going, yeah? I will do. Thank you, Dad. We can go for that. Because that looks incredibly handy. Look at that. I'm into that. Into that big time. I'm getting some treasure. Why not? We're going into this next room, which we're not really going to get too much out of. Really throws me off that this place is called Tartarus. Because... Um, Persona 3, the main, like, crux of the game, like, when... So, basically, Persona 3 runs, like, during the day, standard, like, school life in Japan. But the world of Persona 3, there's this hidden hour between each day. So, when the clock strikes midnight, you get an extra hour that nobody knows about. It's called the Dark Hour. Anyone that is unable to be attuned with a Persona will uh, kind of get put into a coffin, wherever they are, no matter where they are. Um, but the others are able to roam freely and that's when the shadows come out at night But in order to get to the like heart of the shadows in order to beat the game You have to go through this giant tower called Tartarus So whenever I see this in like this game it throws me off Lots of wretchedness to go around I guess Look Prince, I don't hold grudges, you know that But this boulder long as I have you move past the petty stuff so, just want you to know, in case you make it out this time, it's been a real pleasure. Aww. Feelings mutual, sir. Someday you'll have to tell me all about how you tricked father. I might learn a thing or two. Not to worry. We'll take the hundred gold. So, mid-boss coming up, that's what the skull on the door indicates. Um, so it's these twins, but we get a nice wall slam straight away. We'll take it. Just straight extra damage. We'll take it all day long. Um, <clears throat> that's one of the main things that I absolutely adore about this game is that it's a lot of this is contextual. So, like there, he's 
uh, the game obviously knew that I had Poseidon as a um, a boon. Ares is always in competition with his godlike brethren. Um, so he always makes himself sound superior to everyone else. I'm just into it. I think it's a really cool touch. And it just adds to the layers that this game has. And I know I've said layers as in like it was Shrek. Like layers. Can you believe that? That's oh, 20 years old. I can't. I think it's that's a madness. God's grant me strength. Zesty. I could lose 39 health, leaving me on two and gain 44 gold. We're not going to bother with that. We're going to save our money because usually you find... Oh, hey. Nice. Being kind, I guess. Uh, the fountain room. So these are like... This room is one of the passive upgrades that you can get when you... Um, uh, back at the start of the run, you saw me... Um, hey, Kirito is online. <laughs> Um, you saw me go and like use treasure to upgrade something like this is like one of these potential upgrades which I've, it's just a really cool touch I really like it like, it, it helps your runs it makes you you know like last a little bit longer so we can either go for Ares or Hermes Good chat. Couldn't have said it better myself. Felt something. We'll take the 30 gold at uh, darkness. Why not? We'll just may as well use that. Nice. That was too easy. Kieran's shot. Oh my god, that's so lucky. We had that random gold pot in the top corner, which meant that it took us to 151 gold so we can get an Aphrodite buff. You spent your hard-earned wealth on my account, dearest? Why, if that isn't just the sweetest thing. We'll do that. So not only do we have a buff from Ares on our basic attack, we also uh, make them weak. Uh, which reduces their damage output for a couple of seconds. Oh, to Siphony. Murda. Look at how fucked up her face is. This music is fucking wicked. There you go.
Oh, I got stunned. That was a rough fight because they didn't take that Centaur's heart at the beginning. I took the Daedalus instead, didn't I? Hope she won't be back anytime soon. I think we should be okay in Asphodel. We'll try and save that Death Defiance. gonna keep that because i want to make it further than the goddamn hydra today i want to get to elysium at least change of scenery at least all right hermes not ideal but we'll take it unless he gives me like a flat movement buff I don't enjoy it. That's the last of them. I've got a keen eye, boss, so I happen to notice you've got a certain tooth you're carrying about. I know you're in the land of the dead and all, but don't you think that comes across as just a little odd? <laughs> That's cool. What? He meant Skelly's tooth? I could, like, make that slam a lot faster, or every time I go into a new place, I get 10 gold. No. We're going to have to go for the center heart. We got two Ares buffs as it is. So. Like my. Uh, sorry. Boons. Not buffs. My boon setup. I'm okay with. What is this guy doing? Loving life. Okay, so we've got Charon. We're going to go to Eurydice's. Because I don't trust any can shop. I lie. Hey, hon. What's going on? Speak up. Hey, hon. Fuck's sake. <laughs> Well, it's just, I think I wanted to tell you more of Orpheus, since he's court musician in my father's house. Calls you his muse. Says he misses you terribly. I thought you should know. Orpheus said all that, huh? Tell you what, the next time you run into him, you ask him about the time that he came all this way to try and save me, even though I was already dead. Can you guess how that turned out? Ooh, damn. Yes, I do believe I can. Look, I, I didn't mean to upset you. Yeah, well, neither did he. But you know what? Actions beat intentions, hon. Now here, how about a treat and you can be on your way. Thanks. already 
I took the next three boon upgrades because, like, while mine are quite cool, I've got nothing of, like, rare epic. Ep You're new. Oh, apparently we've fought them before. Who's that with? Is that with Poseidon? I mean, that's cool, but it's not going to give me anything because I don't, I don't know if I'm going to get any pumps of power going on. I think the Passion Dash is going to be good. But the next is going to be pretty handy. So we're going to go use that as well. So when I, like, my thinking with the dash was that when I go into the final boss, like the boss of this area, Final boss. I don't know where I'm running to, by the way. Okay, that's the exit. When I dash into them, it's going to do a little bit of damage, but it'll make them weaker. That's my fault. Don't come back. I can't embrace chaos because I haven't got the health requirement. I need more health, but that duo room's really, really calling me. Because I'm going to get two guaranteed upgraded boons. Since when was I ever known for safety? I didn't want to do this. I thought we were close as grapes upon the vine, but I was wrong. Don't take it personally, Dionysus. Have to win him over. Did you just see that? Eight hundred damage. We did it again. We did the exact same issues yesterday. Getting greedy on the call. I'm gonna go for Hermes. Moving right along. I'm not happy, 
but I used all of my death defies. In the name of Hades. But it's all right. We got up to here yesterday, failed, but I have a good feeling about this one. I'm sorry if you can hear that. Unfortunately, my sister is uh, training my dog uh, to play dead and then roll over. And with that comes extra noise. That's what I want to avoid. Those bone slams. Come on. Last one. Thank you, God. Oh, My heart was in my mouth there. I saw how low my health got towards the end there. And I'll be real with you. I didn't think I was going to do it. I thought I was going to start banging my head up against the wall of this goddamn Hydra yet again. Which one? So we can't use the Lucky Teeth anymore. So the reason behind this is so that like the items I just bought is basically so that I can, how do we say it, go in these first couple of rooms, slam a jammer, kill everything in sight, and then get the uh, health back as much as I can. If I can find the room where like a person gives me the option of items and stuff like that, that will make everything a lot better because it means that I will be able to potentially get both of my death defies back which means i'll be able to take on the uh the twin bosses of this room but for now we want to try and put them against barriers so do 300 percent extra damage
None of these are uh, exceptionally great. 5% of 70, so 1 is 7, so you do... I don't know. Like 35 damage? An extra 35 damage on top based on the goal that I got right now. But I tend to use that a lot when I go to uh, Chiron's shop. I'm just going to do the piercing wave. Should work. Like, because it will get my bonuses as well. Uh, right, so... Okay, cool. Yeah, we're just going to go for the heart. Easy. Uh, I haven't got enough for Karen's shop, so we're going to go for Athena. That works well for me because I like Athena. More flame wheels. Should not have taken much damage there, really, but. Well done. You may have quite a distance still to go, but having crossed through Tartarus is no small step, cousin. Yeah, I know that. I like that one. The call from Athena is very cool. We can go up against a mid boss or we can try and level up something here. I'm going to go for the level up. I'm hoping that taking this path is going to allow me to go towards the. Oh, a fountain. Excellent. That flanks damage is going to come in very handy. We did it. We found it. We found it. We found it. The run is on. I'm going to be late to my end stream tonight. Although... Hey, look, I can tell you're struggling right now, and maybe this isn't the way to help you through it all, but I want you to have this. Ah, oh, so you are taking pity on me then. Well, I've no pride like many others here, so I shall take it. Though so let's make it a fair exchange, shall we? Sure. The broken spear point. Mm -hmm. Something wrong there, sir. I mean, shouldn't you be up and about competing for eternal pride and glory and all that? What's the use? Let's say we fought, if anybody asks. Now go. I've no quarrel with you. Besides, I'll just remain here comfortably at rest for some untold millennia, I guess. Mm. Have a nice... I like the tattoo the guy's got on his arm. Patroclus. Patroclus? The Kiss of Sticks premium. I don't know why you would go for anything else. Go for Afro. We'll see what else we get. I'm feeling good now. The run. Suddenly... Not looking so bad at all.
gods have spoken. I haven't given her a gift yet, so I'm going to give her one as well. Lady Aphrodite, I am truly blessed simply to have made your acquaintance, so this is for you. Lasting relationships are built on reciprocity. So if you lavish me with gifts, why, what am I to do but give you something in return? I mean, you're not wrong, girl. The Eternal Rose. Mm -hmm. A little bird once told me that the shade of the great hero called Achilles now resides within your father's residence, dearest. I always wish to meet with him someday. I'm down here, the water's warm. Hopefully we find a boon before the boss room. Oh, come on. That was not great. Mm. Gonna go for some gold. I assume this is the last room proper before the chamber, uh, like before the boss battle, so we're going for it. Yep, that's the boss. Okay. Hmm. I'm feeling quite good about this. But I don't want to like overhype myself. So let's give it a go. Gentlemen, I'm back. Aha, the fiend comes crawling back once more, drawn as he is, much like the unassuming moth onto the flame of righteousness. Alright, mate. No, not the flame of righteousness. Are you finished? <laughs> I've come a long way. Hear that, Asterius? Our fiendish visitor is begging us for mercy. Begging us, no doubt, to drop our guard. Together now, my friend, let's vanquish him and may the glory of Olympus guide us. 
Shame I got hit there. Real shame I got hit there. I can keep at least one death defiance for Theseus. I think we're in a good good place. Uh, here comes the Zeus upgrade. Lord Zeus, I call upon your heart. God damn it. I shall send you to hell however many times it takes. Theseus is just a nightmare to deal with. Even the wave. Just wasn't doing it. Losing to Theseus. I know, right? Never mind. Uh, that was the rare, you know, the run for today. So, uh, if you've watched this far, I'm sorry to have let you down. I've let everyone around me down before, so you get used to it after a while. <laughs> um, don't forget that I do stream regularly uh, on Twitch.tv forward slash MadKid where. I am going to be pretty much flicking straight over to do Silent Hill 3 right now. So if you like your spookies, come and uh, check it out there. If you enjoy it, give it me a follow. Uh, in the meantime, I will try and get back to this. Hopefully tomorrow. I'm not good at... I'm, I've, I've done it three days in a row so far, but I don't want to curse it. Anyway, thank you for watching and I will see you next time.